the top 10 incredible 3D printers. At number 10, the Avriol Labs printer. The 3D printer is really neat because it uses a six axis robotic arm to print objects in cubic meters in size. The extra printing dimension will allow the printer to build higher quality and more durable parts. This machine will likely be more expensive than your average 3D printer. But then again, you can brag about having the ultimate robot printer hybrid slave. At number 9, the Dragonfly 2020. You probably have not heard about this printer, but it's really neat due to the fact that it can print entire circuit boards without any outsourcing. It can print electric circuits with 10 or more layers in a matter of hours. Now, it's definitely not going to build you a cutting edge computer, but it's a really good start for building homemade PCBs. At number 8, the iBox Nano. This affordable printer starts at $300 and is one of the smallest and quietest printers out on the market. The unique resin can print your favorite toys, jewelry, and even crafts. The printer is really unique because it uses UV LED technology to cure its resin, allowing for near silent operation and a dramatic reduction in pricing. On top of all that, it uses a Wi-Fi browser interface so you can even print from your phone. Okay, so now we're gonna get into the really cool stuff and get into number seven, the Bocassini Food Printer. Printing only takes several minutes and it can handle bakery, dairy, meat, fruit, and even vegetable products. Their website will allow users to download food models or even view recipes. The printer is plug and play so it's really easy to use and it's even open sourced. At number six, the Apis Core. This amazing printer can be transported via truck and print an entire building in 24 hours. It can be dropped on site and deployed right away after its easy assembly. It uses very little power and there is no construction waste. One main advantage to the printing method is that it can be 70% cheaper when compared to labor conventional methods. At number five, the Carbon 3D Printer. Being the fastest and most unique device on the list, it works by using light and oxygen to cure a photosensitive resin. Printing can be reduced from hours to minutes and printed objects are more consistent and smoother when compared to conventional printers. Several different materials can be utilized, and now I'm starting to get worried about the evil T-1000 coming out of this thing. Don't expect this printer to be brushed off to the side as it's already secured hundreds of millions of dollars in funding, along with James Cameron's approval. The next printer is number 4, the G3DP. One of the older printers on this list, and known for printing optically transparent glass, it puts a new twist on thousands of years of typical glass making. It uses powder glass and silica to build custom shapes and it's basically laying out high viscosity molten glass while pouring the printed platform. Okay, so it's kind of like the typical glass making, but it's just really evolved into a perfected control form. At number three, the Multifab Printer. Built once again by the great MIT University, the Multifab can print over 10 materials at once. So far, the prototype has printed a few LED lenses and a knife which contains a plastic holder with a metal blade. There are plans to build more complicated objects, including actuators for robots, and hopefully this thing does not turn AI and replicate itself. At number two, the Alsan Microscopic Printer. This breakthrough device can print layers smaller than human red blood cells at 0.001 millimeters. It's likely to replace some semiconductor production techniques, and it'll set a new frontier for building wearable electronics and even micro robots. Now it's anyone's guess when we will see the first multi-material atomic printer, but the all sand printer will definitely set us into the new age of electronics. At number one, the Fabion. There are many 3D bio printers out there, but my favorite one is the Fabion. This is due to the fact that the incredible machine has already built a fully functional thyroid for a mouse. Even though there's been no announcements for immune production of human 3D printed thyroids, you can bet on 3D printers changing the medical world in the next couple of years. So tally on a few decades to your lifespan because you might not have to worry about organ failure ever again. So once again, thanks for watching, like the video, and please subscribe to my channel.